You know, I think we're in an interesting time right now. Um, the industry's been in crisis, in particular the the junior sector, which you know we're in Vancouver. This is the heart of the junior of the junior sector. Um, they've been in crisis for three years now, and it doesn't look like it's going to get better in the you know anytime anytime soon. Prices are are still very problematic. You know, financing is not available. There's also been a real backsliding in some sense at the level of the of the of the majors um, in terms of the understanding of the relationship between a new kind of mining industry and sustainable development. And I think we see it most explicitly in the way language has come to reflect that sustainability is about sustaining the mining industry. And that might include managing social risk and dealing with these other problems and not having conflict be such a big cost and things like that, but it's where the concept of sustainability has come to be about um, the mining sector. And I think that the industry as a whole has really lost sight of, this circles back to your earlier question about the disconnect. Mm -hmm. So to the extent that that is a comfort zone for, mine, for the mining people, I think it's a mistake because it's really meeting, meeting civil society and the broader population on, on their ground, on, on the way they understand sustainable development and the challenges for the future that are going to allow the mining industry to be part of crafting that in that collaborative way, um, not taking on and transforming language like sustainability to be self-serving and to be interpreted as how do we keep our industry going. And it's, it really is, I think, in more and more collaborative work to lay out the, the terms and the way that mining can be done in a given location in a way that meets the needs and expectations of local people who might be in, you know, indigenous people that have been on that land for an uh, uncountable number of, of centuries, or it might be another kind of population. But that kind of collaborative prior work, I think, is, is where sustainable development is captured and, and where the industry has to go if it's not going to continue to be seen. It's not going to continue to have that disconnect mm -hmm. between, between the value system of broader society and, and where the mineral industry is. Mm -hmm. That's my final Good parting point. words. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome.